We're shaking people. Back with another reaction, back with some more rock set. We're going back to the 1991 album Joyride. Wanted to give a big shout out to all the people who've been patient. Um, you know, a couple people have asked, um, it's been over a week. I do apologize. Uh, part of it is I just procrastinated long enough that when it came to the final couple weeks before this big presentation that I have to give, um, you know, I got to the point where I just had to start working on it. So reactions already the last week and a half or so have been varied and irregularly uh, timed, at least in terms of the normal schedule that I would be on. Uh, and for the next 10 days or so, it's going to maybe be even more like that, which is to say I'm going to try to do a decent sized batch uh, for this session of videos. But in the next, uh, again, 10 days or so after that, um, there'll be maybe a few reactions here and there, but we're talking, you know, much slower uh, than my normal pace. Then once I give this presentation, uh, which is set for Monday uh, the 24th, um, and the next day or two after that, I'll try to get back to the regular, the regular um, you know, pace and frequency of videos. In any case, uh, we are going back to Joyride, and the second tune is called Hot Blooded. So it makes me think of passion, it makes me think of visceral experience, feeling things um, as much, if not more so, than thinking about them. Um, although, as I often say, in reactions related to discussions of the heart, um, you know, all that passion, all that feeling, it actually does come from our brain. Now, I get it, you know, the way our bodies work, physiologically, we feel emotions, you know, spread throughout our bodies in certain moments. Um, but again, sometimes people contrast the brain with that feeling and saying, oh, don't, you know, be up in your head so much, you know, feel things and so on. As someone who uh, has studied um, the brain informally, my dad was a neurologist, so I had an interest in it uh, from when I was a kid. I would just say that the brain is actually the source of all that passion and feeling, including that visceral physiological feeling. Nevertheless, that is the sense that I get, <clears throat> that this might be about passion and that felt experience of, um, you know, being hot-blooded, of being... Um, in the moment and wanting something to happen, whether that's a physical connection in a romantic sense or just um, seizing some kind of moment. Now, um, you know, again, hot-blooded makes me think of the distinction between endothermic and exothermic. We are endothermic. Our blood is, you know, our bodies are um, hot by virtue of their biological processes, whereas you know, lizards and other things actually have to get heat from the outside world, uh, which is why they sit on rocks and things like that. Uh, in any case, uh, I don't think any of that is relevant. I think this will be about passion and felt experience. So, um, yeah, looking forward to it. Uh, a number of people mentioned that there's going to be some tracks on this album where Mary's singing just really, you know, brings it home, knocks it out of the park, whatever uh, metaphor uh, serves you best. Um, and I feel like a track with this kind of name is maybe a track where I'm going to prepare myself for some intense singing. So let's find out. This is Roxette. The tune is Hot Blooded, and it's the second track on their 1991 album Joyride. <laughs> That's how we're starting then, yeah. Now you're ready. Hello.
as a long-time insomniac slash night owl. I'm with you there. Ultimately, I think that's the first song where it's ended on her voice as an a cappella. Uh, that was fantastic. Um, and it sounded like it was essentially what I was thinking that, you know, I'm feeling this passion in the moment. Let's seize that moment. Let's take advantage of this. I need your loving. But I am interested by the you can call me miss. It sounds like maybe it's like, look, let's not make this something. Let's not you know, oh, this is the beginning of some long and special like, look, I'm hot blooded in the moment. You don't just call me Miss. Like, don't worry about what my actual name is. So I'm wondering if I'm reading that right, or if that's you know, it's not so much running in that direction. But it did feel in the moment like she's essentially saying, "Look, let's not you know misunderstand what this is. This is passion. This is heat. This is you know me feeling hot blooded in the moment. I need this, but you know, let's not make assumptions about what comes after that." So. Um, yeah, really cool tune, um, and again, her voice did what I expected, although, again, it also did other things that I didn't expect, especially that ending, that was really cool, because she, she, um, very quickly tapered it down and got very delicate as it ended, I enjoyed that, so, um, yeah, really cool tune, uh, I'm gonna try to do one more rock set reaction in this batch, number one, because it had been over a week, and again, it might be over a week till the next one, so, try to get a double in um but yeah ultimately just big shout out to everyone um and i would appreciate your patience for the next like 10 12 days as i get through this project um so in any case do let me know what you think of the tune i will see you next time peace